Welcome to Vidicin Medicine. This is another tutorial on the segment of forensic medicine and the topic today is maceration of fetus. Topics like this are important but may remain unnoticed while we are dealing with huge chapters. So we have decided to prepare videos to take a sneak peek into the important part of chapters. Let's begin. Maceration is seen in case of dead birth and it is a process of aseptic autolysis. When a fetus dies in utero and the ear doesn't enter liquor amni, then maceration occurs and if the ear does, then putrefaction occurs. So, how does maceration occur? The answer is by the process of aseptic autolysis, which results in self-digestion of tissues, releasing lysosomal enzymes, and the enzymes are responsible for autodigesting the organs, and this entire process occurs without bacterial interference. Features of maceration are reddening or brownish pink coloring of skin with peeling and slippage, and this is seen in 12 hours after death of fetus in utero. While describing the features of maceration, one needs to take a note of everything from skin to bones and viscera to brain. The skin is blistered and desquamated and present with large blips which are filled with serous or serosanguinous fluid. Body of the dead fetus is soft, flaccid and flattens when placed on a surface and the abdomen is distended as you can see in the picture itself. Bones are flexible and detach easily from soft tissues. All viscera are soft and edematous and brain has greyish red pulpy appearance and is one of the tissues to show earliest autolytic changes. Umbilical cord is soft, red, smooth and thickened. One needs to examine placenta to see if there is any infarct which could be the potential cause of death birth in this fetus. You need to take a note of radiological signs present in maceration which are robot sign and spalding sign. Robot sign shows presence of gas in great vessels such as aorta and is seen in 12 hours after death of fetus in utero. Spalding sign shows overlapping of skull bones due to shrinkage of cerebrum after death of fetus. It may take few days to 2-3 to three weeks to appear. We hope we could help you a bit. Please like, comment, share and subscribe.